Hello friends. Welcome back to my YouTube channel Vaporai Engineers. Our today's topic is automatic changeover switch. In this video we learn how to make an automatic changeover for generator and main supply. Also we discuss about its power and control wiring circuit. First we discuss about its power wiring circuit. Its main power components are MCB Contactor First MCB is used for main supply or source 1. Another MCB is used for generator supply or source 2. Same like MCB1 contactor is used for main supply and another for generator. Now look at its power diagram. In given diagram both main and generator supply circuit are connected in parallel. MCB of both supply are connected in series with their contactor. Function of series and parallel connection are very useful in control panel wiring. Both series and parallel connection videos are available in my YouTube channel. Let's start its wiring. First connect both MCB with their main supply. After that connect MCB output with contactor. Then connect neutral with contactor. In last connect load with both contactor output. Remember that phase sequence should not change. And type the connection properly. Power wiring is complete, and its working is like that. Only one contactor will work at a time. It means that our output load will be connected to the main supply or generator supply. Power wiring is complete, move next to its control wiring. Subscribe the channel for technical videos. Control wiring circuit. Its major control components are Power contactor of main and generator supply. Auxiliary contactor for main and generator supply. On delay timer for both main and generator supply. Emergency stop for both circuit. We use NC element for emergency stop. 13 and 14, 33 and 34, 43 and 44 are NO point of auxiliary contactor. 21 and 22 are NC point of auxiliary contactor. We also use glass relay instead of auxiliary contactor. 13 and 14 are NO point. 21 and 22 are NC point of power contactor. 15 is common 16 is NC and 18 is NO point of on delay timer. A 1 and A2 are auxiliary supply of all contactor and timer. Now look at its control diagram. As per drawing always remember that, DG supply and main supply are not connected to each other. Emergency stop of both supply are connected with their circuit in series. There is an interlock between main and DG contactor. Timer and O point is connected in series with power contactor coil for delay purpose. Let's start wiring. First connect main control supply with emergency stop. After that connect it with main auxiliary coil. And NO point of timer and contactor. Then connect wire from NO contact of main auxiliary contactor to NC point of DG auxiliary contactor. From other side of NC point connect it with main timer auxiliary supply. After that connect NC point of DG power contactor in series with main power contactor coil for interlock purpose. Function of interlock in control panel wiring video is also available in my YouTube channel. 
Then connect wiring of DG circuit. First connect emergency stop with generator control supply. After that connect it with NO point of DG auxiliary contactor, timer. And NC point of main auxiliary contactor. Then connect it with DG auxiliary contactor coil. After that connect timer coil supply with NO point of DG auxiliary contactor. Then connect a wire from DG timer to main power contactor NC point. After that connect it to DG power contactor coil. In last connect neutral with contactor and timer. Always remember that take both control face from input side of power contactor. Our control wiring is complete. And its working is like that. When main supply is going on, load is connected to main supply. In case of failure in main supply, then load is connected to DG supply. Both on delay timer is used for make a time gap between changeover. Always remember that both the mains and generator supplies are kept separate in the control wiring. Always check the interlock circuit carefully. Automatic generator start stop control wiring video are coming soon. Thanks for watching the video and press the bell icon for latest technical updates.